We develop and manufacture solar simulation systems that are able to simulate sunlight up to 99% of real sunlight. And that's new in the industry. So our systems are being used for quality and reliability testing of solar panels, but also for other components such as plastics and coatings and even car components on degradation effects of real sunlight. My partner Stefan and I were developing a new type of solar panel two years ago and we could not find any accurate measurement equipment to test the quality and the reliability of the solar panel. As such we developed the system on our own and actually immediately after the validation of the system the solar simulation system became much more interesting than the solar panel itself. The ultimate goal is to set up a brand which becomes technology leader in the supply of solar simulation systems to many customers in different industries. We aim that we can enhance the quality and the reliability of products. So that's something that we are aiming for uh, at the same time. And step by step the ambition becomes realistic. Climate Kick supported us in many ways. In the first phase through the acceleration program, we were selected to join the second and the third phase, and we completed both phases. Uh, we joined last year the US Startup Tour, which opened so many doors to customers and a huge network in Silicon Valley. We also participated in the venture competition last year, where we became the winner of the Netherlands venture competition, as well as the winner of the Audience Award on European level. So, a huge help. It's the opportunity that makes me go forward, not the certainty of warranty. I don't like comfort zones. I love to be out there, make something out of nothing and create success of it. That's something that thrives me and motivates me. Uh, I will be not happy when I know what my day job would be from nine to five. That's nothing for me. So this is fantastic. I received a, a great advice from Professor Andrew Isaacs from Berkeley High School of Business. He said, you should always volunteer for everything just to get out of your comfort zone, except when you are in the military. If I had superpower, I would start stopping immediately all the useless wars in the world today. And tomorrow I would start cleaning up all the garbage and junk in the oceans. I would have two busy days. Thank you.